know you're here. Citizens Park. Philadelphia Baker Bowl. Shibe Park right here. 39. Okay. Creaky chair. Okay. Hopefully, I have a 39. So when I open this, it'll look right at Shibe Park. There it is. All right. Now we'll go back to the game. And we're all set now. Things should be the same. Computer, human, let's play ball. Welcome to the stadium for today's ball game. All right, 1915 Tigers against the 1913 Philadelphia Athletics. They won the tournament last year. Okay, here we go. First pitch of the game. Brown is on the hill for Philly. Two and six. Donnie Bush draws a walk. Man on first base. Here's Vitt. Ground ball to third. Baker's at two. Picks it up. Fires the second. Double play. Two down. Here's Ty Cobb. Five and four. That's going to be a grounder to short. Buries at two. Scoops it up. Fires the first. He's out. And Boardwalk Brown holds Detroit scoreless in the first. Here comes the A's. Oldering is leading off. 6 and 11. That's a strikeout for Kowaleski. Okay. Eddie Murphy. It's a base hit to center field. Skips on through the infield. Base hit. Cobb tosses it back in. And here's home run Baker. Grounder to third. Vitt. No handle that. He scoops over to second for one. Back to first. Not in time. One more chance for Philadelphia. And here is Eddie Collins. He's a hitter. Curveball low. Collins checks his swing. There goes Baker on a delayed steal. Throw for the runner. He's out. Nice play. Nice play. All right. Tigers are back up. Here's Bobby Veach. My man Bobby. Come on, buddy. That's a ground at a third. He's out. One down. All right. One down. Sam Crawford. Five and four. Ground at a short. Barry. Going to be busy today. One step. He's out. There's Kavanaugh. That's going to be a double. One to 11. He's got himself a double in the gap. Right center field. Man on second base. Ross, what is it, Ross? Ross Young? What's his name? Ralph Young. Okay. Ralph Young, I need to get his card. Six and two. That's a pop-up to center field. He's going to have that, I think. Yep. I think he might advance. Fly ball. C. That's a weak fly ball. Oh, it's the inning. Okay. Bottom of the second. Here's Eddie Collins. That's going to be a fly ball to center field. Ty Cobb is a three. He should have that. Come on, Ty. Get over there and catch that ball. Rangers over and makes the catch. There's McGinnis. Stuffy. Four and seven. Ground ball to second base. Young will scoop that up. Fire it to first. He's out. Wally Shang. Single. Two out single for Shang. Here's Barry. Six and eight. He pops him up. And Kavanaugh will make the grab on that. And the inning is over. We're going to the top of the third. Score is no score. Oscar Strange. Pops him up. He's out. That's going to be one down. We got the B-Boys on the left side. Here's Kowaleski. He's a good hitting pitcher, if I remember right. Triple one to six. He's got himself a triple, unless they pull it back because he's a W. And inside the park home run. Let's see. No. 
Hell no. My pitcher's out of wind now. He's going to have a hard time pitching. I would. Here's Bush. Come on, Donnie. Knock him in. Base hit right field. Donnie Bush gets an RBI. The Tigers take the lead. one nothing. That up, baby. All right, let's hit and run. Which one is it? Right here? Yeah, let's hit and run. 17%. Steal attempt. She throws high. He's out. All right. I screwed up. Ground ball. He's out. Inning's over. Just try to make something happen, you know? Here's Walsh. Tigers leave. One zip. Struck him out. All right. One down. Here's Brown. Pitcher. That's going to be another strikeout for Kowaleski. He's pounding him up already. He's got three or four. Five and six. Struck him out. Struck out the side. Ah, boy. Here we go, Harry. Here comes Ty. Saka. One and nine. Ground ball to third. Ties out again. It's all right. Bobby Beach ready to make his way to the plate. And he takes his stance. The pitch. It's a line out to second base. Hit it on the nose. Right on the button. Right to him. Didn't have to move. Chris Crawford. That's going to be a pop up the short. The inning is over. Tigers get nothing. After three and a half, it's one nothing, Tigers. All right, Kowaleski back out there. Here's Eddie Murphy. That's going to be a ground ball back to the box. Can Kowaleski handle it? He does, and he throws it in the dirt. Oh, it's an error. Harry. Here's home run, Baker. Ooh, that's a double play ball. Right to the shortstop or third baseman. Get, picks it up, throws it out. Twin killing. Double play. They roll it up. Two outs in the bottom of the fourth. That's a ground ball to second. Young is a two. He should have that. He snares it. Does a 360. Throws him out. No runs, no hits, one error. Top of the fifth. Tigers lead. One zip. That's a pop up to short. He's out. One down. Ralph Young. Pops him up. Second base. Oscar Strange, the batter. Three and seven. That's ground ball to short. He's going to be out. Tigers go down in order. One, two, three. After four and a half, the score is one nothing. Tigers. Here's McGinnis. Stuffy McGinnis. Fly ball right field. There's one away. Crawford will put the squeeze to that. He hit it pretty deep, but he's got it. Here's Shang. Six and five. Oops. He walks. I always inadvertently hit that right quick. It's, my mouse is real pick touchy. Just by putting my finger on it sometimes. One and seven. That's a base hit to left field. Come on, guys, now. Let's not start fooling around here. Here's Joe Walsh. Rocky Mountain Way. Oh, it's Jimmy Walsh. Okay, his brother. Could have been his dad. Four and five. That's a base hit. There's Grandpa. That's going to score a run. One out. Tie score. Come on, I got to go out to the mound here. All right, how you doing? You all right? Okay, come on, give me an out. Let's go. All right, I'll talk to him. He's all right. And you got the lead runner. That's two down. Let's see what happens now. Old runner's up first and second. Two outs. And he's going to fly out to right field. The Tigers dodge a bullet. They do tie the score, though. And he hit a foul ball. The next pitch, he's going to fly out to Crawford. The inning is over. And here we go. Can of corn. All right. After five here at Shive, 13 Philadelphia and Tigers are tied at one. Okay. Brown pitching to Kowaleski. 
pops him up. One down. Here in the sixth. Tigers had a great team in 1915. It was the best, uh, you know, Ty Cobb was in his prime. They were really good. I don't, you know, Boston just beat them out by three and a half games. Or three games. And that was Babe Ruth's rookie season. He was a pitcher. He'll be on the 16 team. Line out the second base. That's the inning. Bottom of the sixth. I got a three team rule. You can only have three teams in the tournament. If you got a fourth, the weakest one has to go in favor of somebody else. Because I mean, when you get to the 40s and the 30s and the 50s of all the Yankee teams, it's crazy. Six and three, struck him out. Yankees dominated baseball for about 20 years. There's Baker from Ruth all the way through uh, Mantle. Five and six, struck him out. Two down. All right. Should have did a tournament with all the World Series losers. That'd be fun. Six and six. Fly ball to center field. Tigers would have plenty of teams in then. All right. We're in the seventh. There's no... Well, we're tied and there's nobody out here in the top of the seventh. Ty Cobb leading off. Come on, Ty. You're due. That's a fly ball to right field. Still hasn't been able to get a hit today. Bobby Beach. The double meister. Come on. Hit me a double. Ground ball to first. He's out. Boardwalk Brown's pretty tough. He's got a weak six, though. Three and three. Ground ball to first. He's going to be out. The inning is over. Bottom of the seventh. And we're going to have the, uh, oh, yeah, seventh inning stretch. Who was Dick Grote's sidekick at second base during the 64 World Series? So that was uh, Philadelphia, right? Uh 64, they played, uh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wasn't that the Dodgers and Twins? Jim Gilliam. That's my answer. I, I, I'm just, I'm throwing it out there. Here's the answer. Del Maxville. Shoot, I don't even know who played. I think the Dodgers played the Twins, but I could be wrong. The Orioles played in 66. No, that might have been 65. The Phillies played somebody. 64. Was it the Cardinals? Oh, I don't remember. I'll have to look. All right, here's McGinnis up. We're in the bottom of the seventh. And that's going to be a home run. One to two. Fly out. One down. Got out of it. Just missed it. Veach, good defender. He's good at everything. Swally Shane. That's going to be a base hit. One and nine. Line out. Dodged another one there. Two down. Kavanaugh spears it. Two away. Here's Barry. Kowaleski pitching a great game. Six and nine. Fly ball, right field. That ends the inning. Tigers need six outs. And they need a run. Okay, same thing for the A's, though. 22,326 fans of Shive Park this afternoon. Boardwalk Avenue. 2 and 3 and 12. That's a pop-up. He's out. Or isn't it Park Avenue or Boardwalk or something? Maybe that's how Boardwalk got his nickname. I don't know. 4 and 5. I'm just guessing. That's a walk. Man on first. One out. Top of the eighth. Strange is up. Six. Nine. Home run one to two. Oh, man. Damn. Flies out. That would have been nice. Two outs. Okay. He was already around second. That is going to be a strikeout. All right. Bottom of the eighth. Number one. There's Walsh. They'll probably eke a run across. That's a single one to seven. And there's a base hit up the middle. 
Hard bounding ground ball through the infield into center field. That's two hits for Walsh. There's Boardwalk Brown. He's going to steal a tip, throw for the runner, he's out. Yes, right on the money. Strange. He's throwing two guys out today. Six and six. That's a fly ball to right field, and they get out of, well, there's two outs. Okay, Crawford squeezes that, two down. Here's Oldring. He hits a double. A do-over. I want a do-over. <laughs> Off the wall. Chases it down. Can't get it. Slide. He'll be in there. It's a double for Lou Boldrin. And here's Eddie Murphy. Yeah, I know. Now they'll get a single. Single. Center field. How did I know? I have VSP. He's going to score, right? Damn right I'm throwing for lead runner. Damn right I'm throwing. Throws the ball away from there. Struck him out. All right, come on. We got to get a run now. It's top of the ninth. Two to one. We're down. And Donnie Bush is up. Four and two. Home run. One to 14. Donnie Bush swells up and hits it out to right field. And a boy, Donnie. Woo. Gone. Listen to that quietness. All right, here's Oscar Vitt. Tie score. That's a base hit. One to 16. Right through. Vitt has himself a single. Okay, man on first. Nobody out. Ty Cobb is up. I should hit and run. What's Ty's. Uh, what's his hit and run? His hit and run is a B. His bunting is an A. I'm not going to bunt. Triple A stealing. Holy smokes. All right. We're going to uh, swing away. I'm not going to hit and run. Four and five. He walks in. First and second. All right. Bobby Veach is up. Now, this guy, had, nobody had more RBIs than him from 1913 to 1927. So, he is an RBI man. He's going to hit the showers. Chief Bender will be coming in to throw his bender at my power hitter, who can hit curveballs. He singles. Yes. Veach hits a single RA2. First and third. Nobody out. Three to two. Tigers grab the lead. One six. Base hit center field for Sam. Sam gets in on the act. First, must decide. 15 plus three plus one. One to 19. Safe chance? I think so. They cut it off to hold the runner at first. First and third. Kavanaugh is up. That's the way to play. Fly ball, right field. This will bring in the run. No sacrifice. Murphy will squeeze it. And there's no chance to get the runner tagging. He uncorks it. Veach is safe on the sack fly. Okay. The throw is wide to the first base side. Five to two. Tigers. It's five and twelve. He struck him out. That's two down. And here's Strange. Not done yet. Base hit, center field. Tigers brought their hitting shoes. One to 19, yes. They hold Strange at first. First and third, here's Kowaleski. Of course I'm gonna let him bat. Six and 10, catcher X might get by him. Oh, no. He dropped it, E2, woo hoo hoo! That scores another run, no? Crawford holds it third. Strange holds it first. Oh, I see. It was a pop foul and he dropped it. Okay. Now we hit a home run. Grounder third. Baker. Got him. Okay. All right. Well, this is it now. Bottom of the ninth. The A's got to score three times. The Tigers' Kowaleski is looking good. Six and four. Single one to eight. There's a base hit for Collins. He's pretty tough. Hitter. Here's McGinnis. One, six, a base hit for McGinnis. Come on now. I knew a change up was coming. 
He's over his pitch count, but I don't care. Struck him out. That's what I like about him. Comes right back. All right. Just one out. Time run is at the plate. Four and five base hit. Shit. Five to three. Joe Walsh. Ah, man. I'm gonna br I'm gonna bring him picture in. He's a lefty. First and second. Harry Davis swinging a bat and coming up. Here comes the pitch. Anything to stop that. Base hit. Son of a bitch. Got a right handed batter coming up, but he's probably going to use a pinch hitter. Let's see. Yep, Danny Murphy. All right, right-handed. None of them look any damn good. I'll go with this guy. All right, here we go. Murphy's up. First and third. Five to four. One out. I can't believe this. Fly ball center field question mark. You got to squeeze that tie. You got to squeeze it. He might tie the game with that. On third, green light. Throw for the runner. Yes. He's safe. Tie game. Son of a bitch! Oh well. That's the way it goes. Fly ball, right field. Gotta catch it, Sam. He's out. Alright, well. Looks like we're gonna have some free baseball. Alright, we're in the top of the 10th. It's 5-5. Five five. Here's Donnie Bush. It's 2-3. for three. He had a home run earlier. Grounder short. Wow, we were up by all those runs, man. Yeah, that's baseball. There's one out. Here's fit. Seven, single one to 16. Base hit. Tigers still want to win. Come on now. Here's Ty. Ty, you got to come through big time right here. Grounder to third. Come on, Baker. Boot it. Kick it. Throw it away. And no problem. Throws out. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, E5. Fit takes third. Cobb to second. Oh, yeah. Thank you. All right. One out with a man on second and third. And the RBI man is up. He walks. Base is loaded. Here's Crawford. Sammy can hit. 4 and 11. Ground ball back to the box. What's Huck going to do with it? He's out. Score it 2 to 3 to 1. Double play. How about that? Damn. Bottom of the 10th, Reynolds is out there. I have no idea if he's any good or not, but what are you going to do? That's a walk. Ah, oh, here comes the damn crowd again. Bowler. He says he's a four against right hand.
that card looks ugly. All right, here we go, man. First fastball at the knees. The runner breaks for second. The throw, he said. And rolls in the center field. Ha ha. How about that? Man on third. Got to bring the infield in, the outfield in. We got to get this guy right here, right now. Three and eight. Ground ball to third. He's not going to advance. That's a hard ground ball. He's going to be out. One down. Running around 90 feet away, Eddie Collins. Pitch to him or walk him and try to turn two. Let's put him on. All right, here comes McGinnis. First and third. We got a double play set up now. Block nicely. Throw for runner. Hold on to the ball. Wally Shang is up. Bowler. I'm going to stick with him. Here's the pitch. Five and seven. Ground ball to third base. Ball game's over. It's over. What? He didn't score? I thought, he, I thought it was a ground ball C. Okay. I won't, I'll take it. There's a base hit. Ball game's really over now. No. Well. You win a few, you lose a few. Final score, Philadelphia A's. Uh, 13, A6. 15, Tigers, 5. A good game for them. They played good. They deserved it. All right, we lost. So that was it. We scored one, then they got one back, and it was a close pitcher's duel. Then we busted out four runs in the top of the ninth, and they came back with three. I made all the pitching changes I could. I just couldn't stop the bleeding, and they got a run in the tenth, 6-5. Kowaleski pitched good up until the eighth inning. Ninth inning, actually. Reynolds takes the loss and gets the blown save. Thanks, Reynolds. Brown, Bender, but it was my fault. I lost that game. You know, managers win and lose, win and run ball games. Huck got the win. If I'd have just known who to play. <clears throat> wow, look at this. Jack Berry had three base hits, two RBIs. The 1913 Athletics defeated the 15 Tigers in 10 innings by a score of 6 to 5 at Shad Park. The game was deadlocked after 5 at 5. After nine full innings, finally, 13 Philadelphia pulled the game out with a, ten, with a run in the 10th inning. Eddie Murphy drew a walk. 13 Philadelphia's manager then called for a steal, which was successful. After an out was recorded, Eddie Collins was walked intentionally. 13 Philadelphia continued their aggressive style. Well, the catcher, the ball was in the dirt, so you can call it a stolen base if you want. The catcher should have caught the ball. Stuffy McGinnis stepped into the box and was walked intentionally to load the bases with one out. And then they got we got the out. I thought the run scored on the grounder because it was a ground ball C. That means a slow ground ball, but he didn't. Then Barry stepped up to the plate and he slapped a single, resulting in a mighty exciting win for the Athletics. 22,000 hometown fans in attendance. Uh, Philadelphia ended up with 12 hits in the game. 15 Detroit had nine. Winning pitcher was Byron Huck. Come on, man. That's my daughter. Ugh. I'll have to call her back. I hate not answering when she calls. The winning pitcher was Brian Huck, who allowed no runs in one inning, and the losing pitcher was Russ Reynolds in relief. He gave up one run, no hits, and two thirds of an inning. Okay. So we saved it, right? Okay. So that's that. Now. 
we've got to go to the next game, which is the. See how my phone? It just non-stop. It never stops ringing and going off. I can't stand it. Sometimes I just have to turn it off. But then I think something important might happen, you know? So let's see now. We gotta go right here. Uh, good win for the A's. It's, you know, they played good. They deserved it. I tried my best, but came up short. What can I say? So, 1913 Philadelphia will advance to play themselves. Right, nope, play the 1919 Reds. They're ranked according to uh, their record during the season. I'm going to have to make that smaller. So they'll play the 1919 Reds. The 1918 Red Sox are ranked first. They had the best record. The 1919 Reds, believe it or not, had the second best record for, from the regular season. The third ranked team is the 1910 A's. The fourth ranked team is the 1916 Red Sox. The fifth ranked team, 1911 Philadelphia A's. The sixth ranked team, the 1917 Chicago White Sox, who will play the 1910 A's. And then seventh was the 1913 A's. Eighth was 1914 Boston Braves. Ninth, 1916 Boston Red Sox. And tenth was the 15 Red Sox, but I put the Tigers in their place. Too many Red Sox teams. We got three of them as it is. Okay, so. That is that. And then the Tigers got to go down here. The loser's bracket. Loser. What game is that? Two. Right here. They go right here. Loser two. Right there. And they'll play the loser of game three. Which is right here. The loser of this game. Oh, great. Okay. So the next game we have is the 1914 Boston Braves against the 1916 Boston Red Sox. And then I'll log off and come back. All right. Here. I'll play this game. I want no... Uh, there's not going to be any uh, semi. We're going to play them all. I hope that game doesn't sim. I think I set myself on every team. Regular. That's good. Okay. Maybe we should have made them on different days. Okay, we're at Braves Field. I'm just going to go computer versus computer. Boston versus Boston. All right, here we go. That's an out. It's a pretty big field. He's out. And he's out. Out at third base. I never see him out. Wow. The babe is on the hill. He's out. Bouncer third. He's got to hurry. He's out. He hits him. Can't believe I lost that game, man. Damn. Had it in the bag. He's out. Wow, that was Marinville. That was a base hit. Braves get a run. They must have had a good team. They got the one of the 
the best records. Oh, that's an error. Who boots that. That's through. Bases loaded. Oh, no, first and third run scores. It's going to go to first to get the out. And they only got one. I'm going to send her a text and tell her I'll call her right back. I'll call you in 15 minutes, honey. Okay. All right, what do we got here? Two to one, Braves. Bottom four. Bouncer to third. Got to hurry. He's out. That's through. Very sick. Short, double play. Fly ball to center. He's going to range over and get that. Bouncer short. He's out. Larry Gardner. He got around. There's a bouncer to second. I see his name on all kinds of teams. I should get that closer to me. I don't know how I'm coming through. I was pretty good last night, a little loud actually. First and third. There's a base hit, that scores are around. Bases are loaded. Red Sox trying to get something going here. That's the third, he's going home, he's safe. That's a shot. Right fielder's going to have trouble with it. He's going to score. Put a runner at second. Four runs for the Reds for the Braves. The Braves are red. Okay. There's a double. Short. He's out. That's the base hit. He's going to score. Here comes the throw. He's out at the plate. Eight to one. Braves. Go to second. Safe. Dick Habitzel. Dick Habitzel. He's Habitzel. Duffy Lewis. Hal Jan. Janvren. He's going to be out. Innings over. Oh, wait, nope. There's two outs. Boston got one back so far. It's eight to two. There's a ground at a third. Long throw. He's out. Wow. Pops him up. And he's out. So he's out. He's out. Yeah, did Dick Grote play on the Cardinals? He must have, because 64. I think the Cardinals won the World Series in 64. Yes. And they played somebody. I'll have to look at it. Hatch Thomas pinches one out. Larry Gilbert, less man's. Bouncer to second. He's out. Two down. There's a fly ball. That's going to be caught. Now well, Boston took it on the chin here for six runs in the fifth. I don't know if they're going to be able to get past that. It's eight to two. The Braves are looking good. Base hit. Burt Walling. Josh DeVore, pinch hitter, walks. Nobody out. Struck him out. 
There's Joe Connolly. There's a fly ball. Did he drop it? Oh, it looked like he dropped it. He did. There's a base hit. Man, Braves don't quit. There's another run. Red Sox are done in this game. That was a big strikeout. Nine to two. They got to score seven times. Jimmy Walsh pinch hitting. He was everywhere. That guy Larry Gardner, though, I see his name on all kinds of teams that went to the World Series. There's a fly ball. That's foul in the stands. Got in his kitchen. McNally is up. He singles. There's two outs. Ninth inning. Fly ball to center. Should do it. It's over. Braves win. 9-2. Babe Ruth gets the loss. James gets the win. Well, the Red Sox only had five hits. They should have let Ruth hit. He only batted once. Walker, one hit. Gardner. They just didn't play very well. The Braves, on the other hand, played very well. They had uh, two hits from Connolly. Four for four for Walling, the catcher. Three ribbies. Two ribbies for Schmidt. And that's it. So Ruth gets the loss. James the win. MVP was Bill James. That's not. That's not the same Bill James I'm thinking of. Can't be. And that's it. Okay, so now the uh, Boston Braves advance. Where are they at? Okay, the score. Might as well put the score in. It's just going to be games, single games. No series. So Boston wins. What was that score? 9-2? Fourteen Boston ends up ends on nine to two. Okay. So the score is nine and two. Okay, and then this team right here. Advances to here. Okay, so they're going to play 1960 in Boston. Wait a minute. It can't be 1916. That's 1912 Boston. I made a mistake there. Uh, I could have made it red. There you go. Now they're going to play the 1912 Boston Red Sox. And the 16 team will go to, this was game one. So they'll go to loser one. Okay, they'll play loser four, and that will be, that's game three, right here, loser this game, that's game four, that looks like six, so this must be game five, I better put that there, game five. Okay. All right. Well, 
the next game will be the I got one more on Stratomatic that I can play but we'll play one more on this one and it is the upcoming 1910 Philadelphia against 1917 Chicago. Just want to make sure that that's on the slate. Yep, right here. The third ranked and the sixth ranked team. That's the 17 White Sox. Is that what I got? Yeah. Okay. And we'll play it. And this will be it. It's a different uh, Shy Park. That's cool. I've got other ones too, better ones. Let's see. That is, is that Shy Park? Must be. No, that's not Shy Park. That is. Let's see. DB fields. Let's see if I got shive in there. It's Braves. That's a good Braves field. League Park. Shive. Don't have shive in that. Probably have it in the M's. Shive. Shive 3, Night. Okay, well, we can put that as the night image. Right here. And I just see what I have here. Shive, shive. That's a cool looking one. That's the one we just played at. That's a nice one. But that is the... I don't know what that is right there. I'd like to see that. But that's not shy. That almost looks like... Oh, I see. There's the lights. That doesn't look like shy park. It looks like something else. I can't remember what it is, though. Let's go with this one here for the alternate image. So I don't think that that is Shy Park. Alright, we'll start at the night one see what that looks like. Looks like. Yep. Okay. That's cool. I like this. All right, so here we go. This is uh, 1917 Chicago White Sox against the 1910 Philadelphia A's. Bouncer to third, he's out. I know I got everything right. There's a fly to center, he's out. Pops him up, and he's out. One, two, three. Here comes the Philadelphia A's. We got uh, two Philadelphia A's teams, three White Sox, Red Sox teams. Bouncer, he's out. And the finals last year, I think, was the 1910 A's against the 1913 A's. And they took them to the limit. They went all five or seven games. It was a little confusing. I remember I played it on out of the park. One of them, anyway. Two outs, he gets his out. Danny Murphy, he's mixing up. There's a base hit. For a second, he's safe. Fly ball, pop up, he's out. Two down. Fly ball, deep right field, he's got that. He walks him.
And he's out. Fly ball left field. He's out. Two down. Makes a boot. Throws a second, he's safe. Throws the third, he's out. Pushed his luck. That's a double, maybe a triple. He's safe. First and third. Oh, they caught him off. Nine drive. The old line drive, catch him off first trip. Oh, he's out. That's hit with authority, but it's caught. Danny Murphy dumps, dumps one into left field, base hit. Frank Baker. He's out. Top of the fifth. White Sox looking pretty good. Eddie Seacott. Here's Collins. He hits a base hit. Man, Collins is everywhere too. He said, a journeyman looking for the all for the World Series team. Hit the double. Hits a double. Jack Berry. Harry Davis throws him out. All the same characters usually in the World Series. Whatever team they go to. They must get picked up or something. He is safe. Pops him up. Got it. E2. He dropped it. That's an out. There's a the base hit. Uh oh, he's floating around with it. He's going to get two on it. It's Buck Weaver. It's one of the uh, Black Sox. He's safe. Bouncer is short. He's out. Well, there's a whole story with that. You know, Kaminsky was being cheap with those guys, man. He wasn't paying them nothing. They were slaves. If he had treated his players right, probably would have never happened. They wanted money. It shouldn't have got dirty, but you know, it wasn't like they didn't have a reason to try to get some money. Even though it was illegal. I just think that Joe was punished unjustly. He hit 383 in a series. How can you say he tried to throw the series? Or something like that. I used to know him, but he, he hit up in the high 300s. I know that. High 360, 370, something like that. He's out. Oh, that's an error. Two to one. Bottom of the seventh. He's going to be out. Man on second. There's one out. They put him on. There's Briss Lord. Hits a shot back to the pitcher. There's two out, second and third. Rue Bouldering again. He's out. Here comes the White Sox. That's an out. Joe Jackson. Shoeless Joe. Strikes out. Happy Felsh. He's going to motor on down to first. There's a fly ball. He's out. Bouncer to second. He's out. And there's a base hit. Baker. Man on first, one down. That's a base hit. First and second, one out. Harry Davis bounces it down to third. He's got to hurry. He's got him. Oh man, two down. They put him. They put him on. He pitched to Combs. He hits a grounder to short. It was a wise decision. We're in the top of the ninth. The White Sox are down by one. This is it for them. They've got to do something here. I'd like to see the White Sox win. 
Roy Shock. Come on, Roy. Ray. Three and on. He walks him. There's the run right there. You gotta get it now. Chick Kendall hits a hot smash to third. He can't handle it in first and second. That's how it happens. Swede Reisberg. And he hits a base hit. Poor play by the third baseman. Is he gonna score? No. Bases are drunk. One out. Seacott throws it. It's it back to the box and he ah, makes the play at the plate. Throw the second ball game. Philadelphia wins two to one. It came close. They had a guy right there, but they couldn't push him across. Take a look at the box score real quick. Not much to see here. Four hits for the White Sox. Nine hits for the Ace. Seacott takes the loss. He gives up nine hits, two runs. Pitched a good game. 1.13 ERA. But Combs pitched a little better. No earned runs. Final score was 2-1. to one. Player of the game was Jack Combs. Okay, so another one bites the dust. And we'll go to the board. And we're going to move a couple of teams here. 19-10 gets two. I'm going to have to log, get, call my daughter back, and I'll come back. One, you get this tournament knocked out in no time. So, that means that the 1910 A's, I don't know if I'm, I might go to a series, I don't know. I just, I always think I'm not going to do it, and then I do it. Just like more baseball, that's all. Copy. Think about what I'm doing here. Okay, he's going to go here. I don't have to make them smaller yet. That's good. For the Sox. We'll go to loser six. Loser six. Right here. <coughs> now I gotta make them smaller. Okay, that'll do it for me. I'll be back, though. Thanks for watching. I always appreciate you. And I will be back. Okay. Tonight. I'll post it. Bye.